every organization, all the ones that represent actual human beings, not banks, want this rule to be saved. None more than the organizations that represent our veterans and our service members. Do you know why that is, Mr. President? It's because they're sick and tired of being cheated by banks. They're sick and tired of politicians who say, thank you for your service, and then turn around and vote to make it harder for them to build a future for themselves and their families. The military coalition, which represents more than five and a half million veterans and service members, supports the CFPB rule because, and I'm gonna quote him, our nation's veterans should not be deprived of the constitutional rights and freedoms that they put their lives on the line to protect, including the right to have their claims heard in a trial. The coalition says that, quote, Forced arbitration is an un-American system wherein service members' claims against a corporation are funneled into a rigged, secretive system in which all the rules, including the choice of arbitrator, are picked by the corporation. And they go on to warn that the catastrophic consequences of these forced arbitration clauses pose for our all-voluntary military fighting forces morale and our national security are vital reasons to preserve this rule.